All right, if that's transforming the whole world, what does that mean for us? Well, here's the first thing. As you well know, we have increasingly sophisticated clients with much more access to information about the services your law firms uh, present and therefore who are demanding more and more transparency and accountability from the service providers. They are telling lawyers to take things that used to come all bundled together and to unbundle them and repackage them in a way that benefits the client and not to bill by inputs, i.e. hours, but to bill by outputs, i.e. value, right? Moving to something which we've all learned, learned to love or not love called value billing, okay? This is also creating new competitors. So we used to think of ourselves as lawyers as competing against other lawyers and really against other lawyers in our home city. Now, not only do we have to compete with lawyers around the world, I'll come back to that in a second, but we also have to compete with a whole range of other kinds of providers who are offering services at the boundaries of the services that we provide. So, LPOs, legal process outsourcing organizations in Bangalore, India, are increasingly doing a fairly broad range of legal work that used to be done by lawyers and law firms. Or take, you know, uh, integrated professional service firms, you know, who offer multidisciplinary services at the boundary of law, finance, competitive strategy, and project management. We have a range of new competitors that we never had before. And all of this is putting pressure on the historic business model of law firms. 